Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past or passing or to come. Hey, V. Happy to see me? Not exactly. Blacked out, then woke up here. I miss anything? Shame you couldn't watch. It was my magnum opus. You'd have loved it. Mean yours and Rogue's, don't you? Rogue's dead. I'm sorry. Afraid things are pretty fucked for me, too. Alt's hitting me with Soul Killer. My nerves are in shreds. You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now, that just raunches. Like, Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when, or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. Felt like my whole body was on fire. Realize now it's not pain at all. It's just some digital simulacrum. Guess Alt's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but... Got no idea if I'll survive or what I'll be if I do. Soul killer, we can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. We're data streams. Certain sensations, inputs can be blocked. Blah blah blah, yada yada. Alt make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture? Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Mikoshi, just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards, only suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now. No. What the? Alt? I made a mistake in the sleeping body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications. The body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. This couldn't end well. We never stood a chance. Don't know why we even fucking try. Cause it's life, it's death, it's the struggle. The hell else are we supposed to fight for? Alt, check again. Parse it all, we gotta be sure. You have approximately six months to live. Okay, okay, j just, just shut the fuck up. I, I need to think. <laughs> Gonna be alright. I said, give me one fucking minute. Oh, come on. 
There's got to be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. All changes were made to accommodate you. Hang on. Telling your ex to kick me out of my own body? The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Give us a what the hell for? So he can trick me into a green? Giving you a free pass, even though he can already do what you want with my body? You're my friend, V. I'd never pull that on you. Never do you wrong. Seeing as how I'm doomed to die. We stick to the plan I gave you. I leave. You stay. Keys to my body are yours. No. It's gonna be me. You lying sack of shit. So what do I do, Walt? Simply cross the bridge. You will become a part of me, as V's body and former life are restored. Are you fucking kidding me? There are no options, you two-faced sack of shit! You're out, I'm in. That was the deal. Okay, easy. Too big a dose of Silverhand wound up in my blood. Need to chill. Listen, if I had to choose who to hole up with on a desert island, it wouldn't be you. Ever. Hell, the whole cast of little big corporate rats would have you beat. Because you're a dickhead. In a big way. And sure, plenty of others out there are more deserving of life. But even so, I never wish you dead. Just promise me one thing, asshole. You won't forget me.
Good morning, V. I trust you had a restful night. Mm -hmm. You have no new messages. You have one meeting planned today at the afterlife. Delamain has confirmed a vehicle arrival at the arranged time. I've noticed your calendar is empty for what we need of the month. Would you like me to begin planning? No, thanks. That's as it should be. Perfect. Have a nice day. Hey, boss. Hey, you there yet? Not yet. He'll be on time, though. His people came to scan the place earlier. Check and make sure everything's clean before he arrived. <laughs> Thought we didn't notice him. And the gear? All set with the heat. Rest too. Full tank, ready to launch. Thanks. Be there soon. Morning, V. Where shall we zip off to today? The afterlife. Head over there. Absolutely. We'll be taking those special air corridors. Excited as I am. So we should make good time. Awesome. My, you look knackered. Hard night. Difficult few weeks. Golly, I'm sorry to hear that. Your incursion into Arasaka Tower has given you all. Respect. Unlimited resources. Now for physical ailments. If it helps, I can offer additional services and spa treatments and whatnot. That may be just the thing for your current condition. In fact, I've teamed up with Trauma Team to provide a medical care package. Limited time offer. Safe travels, I call it. You could try it now. What do you say? As to any medical aid... Day late and an eddy short for that. I'm afraid I don't understand. But you've unlimited resources at your disposal. I'm certain we can find something appropriate and thoroughly satisfying. Don't worry about it. Have it your way. How's the sitch in the city? Arasaka's in a right pickle. An organizational shambles. Its share price has tanked. Public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. Secure Your Soul was to be a mammoth success for Arasaka. It turned into a mammoth curse. They lost all resources related to the program. Mm hmm Promised the rich immortality. Sold them on it. Actually collected engrams and knowledge. A bid for control. For power, I say. In the street? What's the street saying? Rumors about, naturally. You're onto something huge, with someone even huger backing you. Their resources, yet more huge. Nothing much besides. Arasaka's a mess, trying to rein in the chaos. At any rate, you, the afterlife, you're safe. For some time, anyway. Preem. Just Preem. Just take me to the afterlife and floor it. Absolutely. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the stunning views of our fine city. Hmm. Might be the last time I get a look at this place. Are you going to have a nice day? For good. One way or another. In that case, I'll hope to see you again soon. Night City, as my clients note, is a true West Coast gem. Yes, I'm talking to you. They also call it a metropolis of near paralyzing beauty. 
don't doubt it. to keep it under wraps much longer. Won't have to. Take offs today. Today? Is that a problem? No, no, just... In that case, you're gonna need something special. Rogue had this little ritual. Before any big op, she'd knock back a shot of tequila. Silverhand's preferred. Asked her once if it was for luck or whatever. Know what she said? Said it was about remembering. Said that remembering Johnny that way helped her focus on what was important. Anyways, afterlife tradition. I'm gonna mix you up one of our specials. Just tell me who we're drinking. Drink it to Rogue. I gotta say, she'd be happy to see you in her box. Think so? Remember that first time you asked her for help? She was hard on you, wasn't she? Know what you told me later? She said, he's got that blood. Afterlife blood. He'll make the city his or it'll kill him. No third option. Like that was why she decided to help you. And well, she was right. <laughs> that she was. I've long awaited this moment, to look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Talk to me. Well, V, Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you eddies, influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up, my people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Won't be disappointed. Pick the best merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right. In position. Perfect. 
Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. You gonna tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out. Hey V, what's up kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. I'll bet your tunes at the afterlife found you a new Major League Ripper, huh? Them swanky downtown fuckers shooting chrome out his ass? Am I right? <sighs> well, I mean it, kid. Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood. Talk about old times, and I'll take a look at you. Make sure that the new Ripper of yours didn't screw anything up. See you around, V. Hey, V. Everyone's telling me you're a, a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who'd you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you, V. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, V. Hey, V. Long time no see. Let me guess, you still the top of your game in all of Night City? <laughs> yeah. I left all that. I guess I'm just calling to say thanks. For everything. It wasn't until I'd left everything behind that I realized how depressed I was for all that time. 
take it from me, V. If you ever get the chance, just leave. Leave and don't look back. The weight it takes off your shoulders, I, I can't even describe it. All right, enough lecturing. Take it easy, then. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, B, so funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. What did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me? asked if I would go on tour with them. At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, I don't know what else. Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out. B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff for a good cause. I still remember what you did for us, for me and Randy. The city needs more people like you. But I want to make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Before samurai committed to seppuku, they wrote the say, a death poem. It contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late. Some are truly works of beauty. Yet, I am not a samurai. So I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell. Xero. Hey, it's Perales. V, you're gonna wanna hear this. But first, we need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She... She keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. 
But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, oh yeah, and don't forget to delete this message. Hey, V. Listen, I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot. I know, I know the reading's not as strong without you here, but we haven't seen each other for so long, and I... Well, one thing led to another. Know what I drew? Strength, the Emperor, and the world. Babe, the world's gonna hear about you. Go and show Night City what you're made of. <laughs> 